everybody. Today we are showing you guys 50 awesome features which make Exasol the best analytical database in the world. 50 features. You can try them out on your own by starting an Exasol VM on your PC or by registering for Exasol's public demo. Both is for free. If you want to learn more about Exasol, about administering and using the database, writing scripts and much more, take a look at our free online courses in the X Academy, Exasol's interactive video-based learning platform. Take a look at xacademy.exasol.com and register for one of our courses today. So let's start the video. Here are the 50 most awesome features of the Exasol database. Community Edition The Exasol Community Edition is a free single node database that has all features. You can simply run it under VirtualBox or another VM player on your local computer. Distributed Database The Exasol database can run as a single node system, but typically you run a multi-node Exasol cluster to achieve fault tolerance and maximum performance. Easy Integration the Exasol database can easily be integrated in any data warehouse architecture. Import data from different data sources into Exasol and write queries or use BI tools to create reports, build charts or make predictions. Standard SQL Exasol supports the SQL standard almost completely. You do not have to learn a new language and you can reuse your existing queries, views and applications. Compressed Storage All data in the Exasol database is stored in compressed blocks. This way, one terabyte of data typically only consumes 300 gigabytes or less on disk and in RAM. Distribution Keys Distributing two tables by the joint columns means that joints can be executed locally without the need to find joint partners over the network. Partition Keys when you often filter by a specific column, for example a sales date or tenant ID, partition by this column to reduce the memory footprint of your queries by storing similar values next to each other in data blocks. Automatic index creation and maintenance. Indexes are automatically created when they are needed for performing joint queries. This means when you perform a similar join once again, the index is already there and the performance is drastically increased. Column-Oriented Storage A column-oriented storage model is optimal for analytical queries because a bunch of column values is stored next to each other in a data block. This helps a lot of queries with aggregation functions, filters, joins and sortings. In-Memory Processing Did you know that in a typical Exasol system nearly all queries are executed in memory, even if the database size is much larger than the amount of RAM? This is achieved by using intelligent in-memory algorithms. Massive Parallel Processing For each query, all nodes in an Exasol cluster help in answering this query by applying filters and joins locally. Automatic Failover Due to a redundant storage of data, a standby node can jump in if a node fails. So, no data is lost in the case of a failure and the database is up and running again. ExaCluster OS Exasol runs on its own operation system. ExaCluster OS It is based on CentOS Linux and offers easy installation and cluster administration. Commodity Hardware You can install Exasol on standard server hardware of the vendor of your choice. Cloud Instead of using Exasol on-premise, an Exasol cluster can be set up on AWS, Azure or Google Cloud with a few clicks. SQL Clients You can connect to the Exasol database with an SQL client of your choice. The tools DB Visualizer Pro, DBiver and Datacrypt offer many Exasol specific features like system monitoring or profiling. Profiling after you executed a query, you can inspect the query profile. It shows you all details of how the query was executed, like the order of joins or the usage of indexes. Drivers Exasol offers JDBC, 
ODBC drivers and many more. For programming languages like Python or R, you can also use a native interface. BI tools. Nearly all popular BI tools are able to connect to an Excel database to create your reports, for example, Tableau or MicroStrategy. ETL tools. You can develop your ETL jobs directly within the Excel database. But you can of course also use a graphical ETL tool like Alteryx, Pentaho or Tenant. Import command. With the import command, you can easily import table data from an arbitrary external database, for example an Oracle database, or from files on a server. Export command. Of course, you can also export tables in other databases or files. XML RPC interface. Using Exasol's administrative XML RPC interface, you can programmatically send commands to the Exasol database, for example, to start and stop a database or to retrieve monitoring data. Logging. You can inspect, search and download server logs directly in the web front end Exa operation. Furthermore, monitoring data about the whole cluster system can be inspected via system tables. Backups. With one single click or by defining a backup schedule, you can create backups of the complete Exosol database. It is either stored locally in the cluster or on a remote server. Documentation. In the online manual, you find a complete and detailed documentation of all Exosol features with a lot of examples. Schemas. Database objects like tables, views or scripts are stored in schemas. The schema owner has a full access to these objects, but of course you can also grant privileges to other users as well. Virtual schemas. A virtual schema looks like a physical schema, but it's just a virtual link to an external database. This way, you can simply write queries to multiple source systems without moving the data into Exasol. Built-in SQL functions. Hundreds of scalar functions and aggregation functions are built in to work with date values, strings, numbers and geospatial data. Analytical functions. Exasol has a full analytical function support compliant with the SQL standard. Use it, for example, to calculate ranking values, cumulative sums or moving averages. Merge command. The SQL command merge copies data from one table into another and it can handle conflicts like updating a row in the target table if it is already there. Acid transactions. Exasol uses the strongest isolation level serializable to support acid transactions and avoid multi-user anomalies. System tables. By querying system tables, you can inspect the schema of your Exasol database. They show you all database objects like tables, views, users or scripts. Auditing. When enabling auditing, each and every query that is sent to the database is locked in the audit tables. Administrators can inspect these tables to see a detailed history of all SQL commands. Session management. System tables like the Exa All Sessions show you who is connected to the Exasol database. If you want to kill a session, simply use the kill command. Primary keys. Exasol supports primary key constraints to guarantee valid and unique primary key values. But when you deactivate them and manually check these constraints, the performance of data loading tasks will increase even further. User management. When administering users' roles and privileges, you can specify password complexity rules, password policies and expiry rules. Furthermore, you can use LDAP or Kerberos servers for authenticating users. Priority groups. By default, each user has the priority group medium. You can control the amount of resources for executing the queries for specific users by changing it to low or high or by creating custom priority groups. 
Lua scripts. Lua is a very simple to learn language. You can create Lua scripts to define batch jobs, simple procedures and complex ETL jobs. Preprocessor scripts. You can develop your own preprocessor script to transform the queries that are sent to the Exosol database. This way you can make your legacy tools work even if they send invalid SQL commands by translating them into a valid command. UDF scripts. Exasol's UDF scripts can be developed in any language of your choice. For example, Python, Lua, Java or R. This way you can develop your own scalar functions, aggregation functions, user-defined imports and exports or analytical functions. Extensible scripting languages. In your UDF scripts you can add packages or libraries. A lot of them are built in in the Exosol database. All others can be simply be added by uploading the packet files into BucketFS, a synchronized file system on the Exosol nodes. Machine learning. Develop machine learning algorithms directly within the Exosol database. This moves the calculations directly to where the data is stored and utilizes the whole cluster power. Skyline queries. The preferring clause allows skyline computations in Exasol. You can find rows of your tables that are not dominated by others with respect to a specific criteria. For example, you can find the optimal cars by preferring a low price and a high horsepower. Geospatial data. You can store points, lines, polygons and other spatial objects in columns of type geometry. Dozens of built-in functions allow you to calculate distances, overlaps and spatial joints. The automatic creation of spatial indexes makes these kinds of calculations very fast. Grouping sets. Avoid using union queries by combining multiple groupings into one grouping set specification. Exasol also supports the roll-up and cube operator. Connect by. Hierarchical queries are possible with a connect by clause. It allows you to write recursive queries when your data forms a tree or graph structure. Query Cache Many complex analytical queries return only a very small result set. Exasol's Query Cache caches these results to improve the performance of similar queries a lot. Connectors a lot of connectors to Hadoop, Spark, Kafka and many other systems are available in Exasol's GitHub repositories to integrate these tools with the Exasol database. Fastest analytical database. Last but not least, Exasol ranked first in the decision support benchmark TCPH. It executes your analytical queries much faster than any other database system. Yeah, these were the 50 awesome features of Exosol. I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you learned something new. If you are new to Exosol, take a look at our free online courses in the X Academy. There you learn all Exosol essentials, how to administrate, how to use the database, we have a performance course and you will learn everything about writing Lua scripts and UDF scripts. Register for course today. We hope to see you again in the X Academy. Thanks for watching this video.